An update now on a story we first told you about last night on Eyewitness News. Only our cameras were there as the state's environmental police removed live frogs and turtles from the Good Fortune supermarket in Providence. And the health department saying it's against the health code to sell these types of live animals at a grocery store. Eyewitness News reporter Kim Kalunian joins us now live in studio with the new details. Kim? Well, Mike and Caroline, today the DEM removed roughly 45 frogs and seven turtles. Now those animals are with a pet store that specializes in reptiles as the investigation continues. Taken out in crates, only eyewitness news cameras capturing environmental police removing live frogs and turtles from the Good Fortune supermarket on Providence's Cadillac Drive Wednesday morning. When we get a complaint like this, we really um, we take it very seriously. We send investigators out immediately. Department of Health spokesman Joseph Wendelkin says a complaint came in Tuesday that the Asian market was selling live frogs and turtles. A concerned customer sent us these photos of the frogs stacked tightly in display tanks. The turtles were individually bagged. Rhode Island Food Code doesn't allow live animals to be available for sale in food establishments. There are certain exceptions, like you said, um, lobsters and other crustaceans, shellfish, whereas uh, frogs and turtles don't fall under one of those, of those exceptions or exemptions. And that really comes down to um, specific diseases. Diseases including salmonella and listeriosis. When Delkin says the owners of the store are cooperating, the supermarket is one of a dozen in states across the U.S. When Delkin says the store was inspected prior to its grand opening about two weeks ago. We were not made aware that they intended to sell live frogs and turtles, obviously. And today, a spokesman for the DEM said in a statement, quote, we want people to know the animals are safe now and our ultimate goal is to place them where they can be safely and legally kept. Now, when Delkin says there have been no reports of illnesses associated with the Good Fortune market, but if customers have concerns or want to report symptoms, they can call the Department of Health at 401-222-5960. Now, he also said that the store will not be fined, but the health department will be conducting unannounced inspections in the future. Live in studio, I'm Kim Kalunian, Eyewitness News.